Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Hardcore Minecraft. And today I am back uh, looking for the uh, the Woodland Mansion. Now, last episode I did a bunch of exploring, and I've made my way all the way over, like, really far away from the house. I think I'm like 10,000 blocks away from home right now. Uh, which is a really far distance. And I still have not found myself anywhere close to the being on the map. So before I head back to the house, I did want to do an experiment. I have a, uh, a blank map. Or at least I s hope I still have the blank map on me. Yes, it's right here. So I've got this empty map. I want to go ahead and create an empty map of this location. So now what I want to do, now that I've got this blank map, if I go on my dragon, which is uh, right over here. If I go ahead and grab the dragon, fly off of the blank map in this direction. Actually, let's go in this direction because that would be more accurate to this map. If I fly off and go left, the dot moves left. If I go right, the dot moves right. If I go on this map, move left, the dot goes left. If I go right, the dot goes right. So, using that logic, I have a feeling this map is actually in that direction. Which means I've been traveling the opposite direction this entire time. Which is why I'm not getting any closer. So, I can either go this way... Probably about another like 10,000 blocks until I find the Woodland Mansion. Or I can, uh, wait, where did the dot go? Uh, dot? Wait, where, where did the dot go on this map? That's weird. The dot has just disappeared. Is the map broken? This map still has a dot. That is really strange. Where did the dot go? It was just on the map. Okay, that's strange. I don't know where the dot went. Uh, but I can either keep going in the, uh, the correct direction and uh, try and find this dungeon. Or I can head back to the uh, stronghold and explore that. And uh, see what kind of cool loot and stuff I can get over there. Since I already know where the stronghold is at. So, that's what I'm going to do today, is I'm going to head back to the Stronghold. Uh, I'm not going to be going to the end in this episode. I was thinking about possibly going to the end. Oh, look! Here's the jungle biome. Yes! Okay, this is one of the, uh, the biomes that I need for uh, my achievement. So, let's see. Where is that at? Uh, it should be right here. Yeah, I've got 31 of 36. So, if I explore this jungle biome, that should go up. Now, there's also some uh, jungle temples in here as well. So, if I go and open up this, am I in a jungle biome? Oh, it's the jungle hills, apparently. So, does that count as a biome? Oh, yeah, here's the natural jungle biome here. So, I've seen at least two types of jungle biome. Oh, yeah, that actually did count for two. So, jungle hills and regular jungle... Uh, I need three more biomes to find. I don't know if you actually have to find every single biome. Or if like the biome... Oh no. Uh, there's some rare slimes up there. I don't know if you have to find every single type of biome. Or if you can find like multiple variants of a biome. If that counts. Now we've got these hardcore dungeons over here. But these ones look a little bit different. I'm going to get rid of this map because I think that map's broken. Uh, but we've got this, uh, jungle-themed, like, hardcore dungeon. I have no idea if this is any different to the regular, like, cobblestone ones. But I want to at least check. Do I have any blocks? I've got sandstone. So I can use this to block that up. There is a chest down here. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're not going down there. Uh, I do want to explore the, uh, the chest up at the top here. But I gotta make sure this is blocked up. So, let's see what's in here. Hopefully, there's some good stuff. At some point, I want to see what's in the uh, other chest, like on the lower floors. 
because there are uh, other chests in this dungeon. Oh, there's a different type of chunk here. All right, I'll take that, and then uh, all of the uh, other stuff. I'll go ahead and take this. So there is actually a different type of like jungle dungeon that shows up here, which is pretty cool. Uh, now I do want to put some of the stuff in my bag if I can. Uh, we're going to put this chunk. What do you actually use this for? Alright, apparently these are actually useless. There's no purpose for the ingots yet. Uh, but if you get all the different chunks, you can make them. And another star. So there's really no point in getting uh, the chunks, uh, it seems like. Uh, but the one thing uh, that I can get from these dungeons that's good is loads of uh, resources. Uh, now I did want to check... Uh, to see if I can actually get into the chest that's in the lower part here. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Uh, I probably uh, should get some uh, jungle wood so I can actually build a platform. Now, I should be able to just chop down one of these trees uh, with the tree capitator mod. If I go and grab my axe, which is not in my inventory, is it in here? Okay, so I've just checked out my uh, biomes, and apparently I found another one. I don't even know which one it was. It's, I guess, some variants of jungle, because that's the only biome I've been in. But now we're down to just two biomes left to find. Uh, I'm hoping I can find them on my way back home, because then that is, I think, one of the harder challenges done. Uh, the, another one that's going to be really difficult is going to be uh, the secret one. I forgot what it's called. I think it's the how do we get here achievement where you have to like get every single possible uh, like effect on you at one time. That one I feel like is going to be pretty tough. Uh, but I do want to try and get this chest that's in the uh, the second layer of this dungeon. But to do that I need some blocks to build up with. So if I break my way in here I should be able to open up the chest by uh, breaking this and hopefully none of the spiders can get out. I don't know if they can fit through one block gaps, but I'm gonna block that up just to make sure they cannot get through. All right, let's see if I can get in this chest. The way I'm gonna do this, is I'm gonna break one block, put the wood back, so that way nothing can get me through. There we go, we got the wood put back there. There are definitely some uh, crazy mobs in there. Uh, oh, I've got some enchanted books. A oh, mending book. Yes, I'm going to take that. Uh, let's take the sharpness 5 book. It is very loud. Extra shield. An extra diamond axe. Don't think I need any of that. There's also a melon down here. Which, uh, I have no idea if I have melon seeds or not. But melon seeds might be, uh, good to grab. So, do I have a bed on me so I can sleep? Hopefully, I'm uh, far enough away from the mobs. Yeah, there we go. I can sleep. So, let's see uh, what other biomes I can find on the way home here. Jungle is definitely a good one to find. That one's pretty difficult. The only other biome that would be really hard to find is uh, a mushroom biome. But looking at how many biomes I've got left... And that it looks like the different variants. Wait, what is that? Is this a tree house? What is this over here? I have no idea. It's like a tree house. Let me explore this. But it looks like the different variants of the biomes do count for uh, the achievement. So I should be able to just get it done just by kind of exploring around the world. So, is there anything up here, or is it just a tree house that you can climb up? That seems to be it. I don't know which mod adds that in, uh, but it doesn't seem to be anything else. It's just a uh, little bit of wood in a tree, which is cool. So, I'm going to start making my way back towards the uh, the house now. Hopefully, I can find some more biomes. How many am I up to? 34. So, I haven't found any new ones. Uh, I'm trying to think what other, like, jungle variants there are. Because if I just, like, fly through the jungle biome here, 
I might be able to find another one because this is regular jungle and then jungle hills. Uh, there might be jungle extreme or something like that. I have no idea. Uh, but there's a bunch of these tree houses around here. I don't think any of them have anything in them. But I've been seeing a lot of them around here. It just looks like jungle trees that have like a little bit of a platform to them. Uh, but this is really cool that I found this. This is still uh, hills. There might be hills plus. I think is a variance that you can find. But it doesn't look like we have a... Uh, a hills plus maybe this this looks pretty tall over here okay so I'm on my way back to the house here and I'm only like 2,000 meters away and I've ended up finding another donkey after uh, last episode I don't really need the donkey but I want to see if I can try and tame it and bring it home with me because it's not that far away I could probably ride the donkey but I don't know how uh, how slow the uh, the donkeys are. This one could be pretty slow, and it might be faster just to take the dragon. But uh, taming him is uh, a little bit difficult. But there we go. I was able to tame him. Now I can make my way back home. Okay, so I finally made it back to the house here, and I've got the donkey with me, which is really good. Uh, so what I want to do now is bring him inside if I can. Go ahead and get the doors open. And I'm going to put him over in this area. So what I want to do now is I want to make sure I've got a terracotta chest. Which I do have a terracotta chest, but it's not linked to the sorting system. So what I want to do is I want to take one of these uh, chests here. Uh, set this up to do terracotta. So now that I've got that set up, I'm going to go ahead and... Oh wait, I think this is out of fuel i don't think the sorting system works right now yeah it's out of fuel which is annoying all right so i found a little bit of heavy oil here i can put that in uh the engine i have no idea how long that's gonna fuel it but hopefully it's enough so i can uh, get these items going through the sorting system i do want to drop off these enchanted books over here so I'm just going to go through, empty out my inventory real quick, and I'll see you once I make it over to the stronghold. Okay, so I'm back over here uh, where the uh, stronghold is at. Uh, apparently I left my bed at home, and I also misplaced my excavator, so I don't know where that went. Uh, but I am going to be underground, so I'm not really too worried about sleeping, because uh, there shouldn't be any mobs that are going to come down here and attack me. Everything that's going to attack me is already going to be down here. So I'm just going to make my way down into the dungeon and just kind of start exploring around, see uh, what kind of loot I can find. I do have my axe, so I can grab up bookshelves. Uh, so if I go over here to the library, grabbing up these uh, bookshelves would be really good. What is this? Power 4, sharpness 3, efficiency 4... And Respiration 3 all in one book? That is crazy. Is there another chest in here? I have no idea. I'm going to take the chest because it's uh, worth a uh, wood. And I always need more chests for making stuff. Uh, but I definitely want to collect up all of these books. I should put Silk Touch on this axe. And I did actually get a Silk Touch book from uh, my exploration. That would make this way easier, so I don't have to, like, recraft the bookshelves. Because the problem with this is you get the books back, but then you have to make the bookshelves again. If you had a Silk Touch axe, you could just immediately grab the bookshelves themselves. Alright, so I've grabbed up all the stuff that was in the library. Now, the cool thing about having the uh, minimap mod is that I can actually see... Uh, kind of like where the rooms are at now. I'm definitely gonna grab some torches so that I can see down here Now there is one of these rooms over here that does have a chest up at the top Let's see what's in this chest. Oh, there's some redstone. I'll take that and a looting to book Look at all these enchanted books. I've got already So I'm gonna keep going around 
Uh, there is a cave that goes this way. Oh, there's emeralds here. Oh, great. No, you can get out of here. Got fake emeralds, apparently. Now, it's actually uh, a bunch of, like, orbs down here, because I'm pretty low. This is level 15. Oh, there's actually diamonds over here. I didn't even realize that. We got diamonds, uh, which uh, I have no inventory space to pick up. Let me put down all this stuff now that my uh, backpack's nice and empty. We're going to put everything in there. I don't really want to go do a lot of mining, but I will at least grab the stuff that's over here. Because we got all the different ores. We got gold uh, over there. There's coal that's right there. Redstone. Lapis. I don't think there was any emeralds here. Uh, there was emeralds back over there. But pretty much all of the ores were right in this spot. Oh, that's a spider. That's great. But I can get some gold and some redstone here. There's even more gold. Look at all this gold that's back here. Oh, no, 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 no. You can get out of here. That would that could have been bad. Yeah, that's the only problem with doing this mining is every so often you do get a rare spawn of ore. Uh, now it looks like there are some mobs over here. Oh, it's a skeleton. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here. Uh, I don't have my shield on me. Oh, and there's some iron over here I can grab up as well. I think I'm pretty good on resources at the moment, so I'm not really too worried about doing any mining. Uh, but I just want to look for chests in the dungeon here. Uh, which if I look at the map... Oh, great. We got a zombie with full gold armor. Let's get you out of here. He picked up my door that I broke earlier. It sounds like there's some sort of a uh, tornado that's possibly happening. Alright, here we go. I'm back in the dungeon. So there's the end portal there. Uh, my staircase is right over here to get out. So let's head up top and say uh, what's happening. Hopefully I don't get sucked up in a tornado once I get up here. So maybe there's nothing happening up here. Let's see. This is grass. Oh yeah, there really isn't anything going on up here. So I think this is a, uh, a good time to uh, end the episode here. I've explored around the uh, the stronghold, found a bunch of really cool stuff. Uh, how am I doing on biomes? 34 still. So I still need to find two more biomes, which I'm not sure which ones those are. Uh, one of them is probably the, uh, the mushroom biome, and then the second one, I have no idea which one that would be. But I at least found the jungle biome, which... Uh, is really good because that's one of the rarer biomes to find but that's gonna be it for today so i'm gonna go and end the episode here so make sure to leave a like and to subscribe thanks for watching and i will see you next time goodbye everybody